Peace and love and welcome to The Daily Brief. We are continuing to celebrate 50 years of hip hop and today it's all about the ladies. We are highlighting the group Salt and Pepper who along with DJ Spinderella was the first female hip hop group in history to hit platinum sales of over a million copies and are known today as the first ladies of rap. Now we had a chance to catch up with Salt from the legendary group to get her perspective of hip hop today, ladies in hip hop and more. Take a listen. What do you feel your group's influence on hip hop has been? Um, I feel like Salt and Pepper brought fun, fashion and femininity to hip hop. Uh, we were just some roundaway girls doing our thing, being authentic, being real, being relatable to a lot of women and men. And that was a huge part of our success as well as timeless music. How do you feel about women in hip hop today? I have mixed feelings because I just feel like it's kind of one-sided right now. But what I do love is the fact that women are taking more control of their business, of their finances. You know, they're not like slaves to record companies or man camps anymore. Social media and how everything's changed has afforded them to be able to be more in control and take care of their business. I respect that. Now this is the 50th year of hip hop. How do you feel about where it's been and where it's going? They used to say, will hip hop last? Like journalists would ask us that. We got so sick of that question. We were like, I don't know. But here we are 50 years later. And I think that it's just contributed to so many things, fashion, culture. It's the only genre of music that infiltrates every part of, of entertainment. That was such a fun interview. Now, for the latest in Black news, you want to head on over to LASentinel.net. We have a new look. We have more news that's impacting the Black experience. And don't forget, The Daily Brief is available wherever podcasts can be found. I'm Miel Anderson, and you have just been debriefed.